What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Got another movie reaction for you. Finally wrapping up the Bond series with Daniel Craig. Finally. <laughs> Finally. Fantastic movies, amazing series. Can't wait to see how they wrap this up. The stories, the characters, the villains were all fantastic. They were. The last one actually survived going into the final movie. Crazy. That's amazing. Yeah. Can't wait to see how that goes. A Bond girl survived too. Holy cow. Shocking. Unbelievable. These movies have been so good. They're funny. The action's incredible. The story's really cool. And if you didn't know, we do movie nights every single week on the channel right here. Sure. You just got to find that notification. Click on it. Come join us. Yeah, we have fun here. I tell dad jokes and annoy the hell out of him. So, <laughs> and possibly you as well. We have a blast live streaming with y'all, so you should definitely come and roll through. And if you're not into that, we do post on the Patreon. There's a link to that down below if that's your thing, if you want to come watch the full watch alongs. But yeah, here we go. Bond, no time to die. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. We're amazing. We're so fun. <laughs> that was a really cool overhead shot, by the way. Madeleine! Oui, maman! Ce soir, c'est mon ange! Uh-oh. Je sens que papa rentre. Poor child. Et d'après toi, il fait quoi, papa? Il est docteur. Ton papa, il tue. Jesus. Oh, what? Oh, hell on earth. Oh, God. Uh oh. The Spectre Ring. Mm. <gasps> Oh my God, Jesus. This feels like the strangers. I mean, I don't know what it is about really simple, plain looking masks, but like, that's scary. That's creepy. Is Mr. White home? He's gone. My name is Richie Fierzafi. Your husband killed my family. Oh, is this a flashback? This will hurt him more. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh God. Oh no. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Good for you, girlfriend! <laughs> oh man. Wow, dude. Oh, this is wild. Are you serious right now? Wow. Wow. That is, oh, what the? F Onto a frozen oh, lake. Are you joking? This fucking Michael Myers or some shit? Right? Like, what the hell? It's Jason. No fucking way. Oh! <gasps> 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 Oh my God. The, the casting is amazing because that little girl looked identical to this woman. That was a wild open. So it's a little backstory to her situation mm -hmm. as a child. Mm -hmm. How's the view? It's growing, me. Can you go faster? We don't need to go faster. We have all the time in the world. Oh, that sounds very ominous. Oh, um, what's up what with the, the hell? fires? It's gotta mean something that's like special, right? 
You can't help looking over your shoulder. No one's coming. I wasn't looking over my shoulder. Yes, you were. No. Are we going to have a round of it? He's Bond. Of course he's going to be looking over his shoulder. I, I hope so. Secrets, wishes, letting go of the past. Nice. Need of all things, income than you. Is that a foreshadow? It feels like it. Is more stuff in the past going to... I mean, obviously, we got a flashback to her as a child. We're going to get more focus on the past and old things. Do we have to worry about her because she made it through the I, first movie? That's what I'm worried about. Especially worried. what he just said in the car ride. We have all the time in the world, yeah. <laughs> but it's no yeah. time to die. It's the I name of the movie. Hmm? Tell me. I'll tell you if you tell me about Vespa. Is that why we're here? She's buried at the Acropolis. I know where she's buried. Can you forgive her for us? I left her behind a long time ago. As long as we're looking over our shoulder. Past is not dead. You have to let her go, even if it's hard. You mean, um, a way to have a future? Mm hmm So I do this, and then... I'll tell you all my secrets. Burning the past. Let the past die. I mean, that is an incredible visual, that wide shot of all those fires separate burning. fires burning. Mm -hmm. I thought something bad was happening at first. I'm gonna go and do this, and then I'm gonna come back for breakfast. That, I feel like that's not gonna happen. And then you're gonna tell me where we're going next. <laughs> like, can they make it any more obvious that something's gonna happen? <laughs> Is like her past gonna show up and kidnap her or something? That's what it feels like, if not kill her. Wait, this is a burial ground? Oh. Beautiful. I miss you. Oh, shit. <gasps> no! What the fuck? Her grave! Was this a setup? I mean, the timing would have to suggest so, or someone is still watching him. I love that you can't hear. It sounds muffled. Oh, shit. Yup. Uh oh. Is something connected to Blofeld? Oh, shit, turn around. <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? Oh! The most strategically placed speed bump you've ever seen in your life. Oh, shit. Does he have a bulletproof jacket on? Like, that shit bounced off. Oh, my God. Heights! Heights! <laughs> heights! Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God dang. Oh, Whoa. this guy. What's up with your eyeball, bruh? Oh, that haircut, though. Is that the situation? <laughs> oh, bitch. Oh. <laughs> that was fantastic. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, with the clothesline. Literally, with the clothesline. Blufet sends his regards. Yeah, you fucking called it. Love that sends his regard. She's the daughter of Spat. Oh. 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 What the? <laughs> wow, dude. Now, I don't think I could. Oh, that's terrifying right there. Driving a motorbike down that stuff. 
That's fantastic. I mean, that, like... Okay, stop it with the tricks. If you were skilled on a bike, that shit would be fun as hell. Okay, is this a funeral? You're... Oh, God. Whoa! Okay, shut up. <laughs> shut up right now. You shut up. Oh, my God. I needed to see a bike off between Bond and Hunt. Your baggage is already down, Mr. Bond, as your wife requested. Uh-oh. This was a setup. You're right. Letting go is hard. Oh, that sucks. What happened? Huh? How did they know I was here? How did they know I was here? I have no idea. What Spectre, you're... how did they know? What are you talking about? Oh, no. I, I can't tell. I can't tell if this was a setup or it was not. God. I mean, Blofeld proved in the last movie that he has some absolutely insane surveillance. So, like, I wouldn't be surprised if just because he got apprehended doesn't mean he didn't have people still working underneath him following them. But she could also be a mole. This is fantastic, though, this driving scene right now. Drifting on a whole new level. Oh, sh <laughs> that dude was pissed. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, is she in on it? Is she not on it? I mean, dude was yelling that she's the daughter of Spectre. Like, that's... Yeah. She's who we're talking about, right? Yeah. It's Blofeld, my love. Your father would be so proud of you. Your sacrifice will be our glory. Are they setting her up? They might have planted some stuff on her or using To make phone. it look like? We all have our secrets. We just didn't get to yours yet. Oh. Oh, no! Not the sheep! Oh my god, the sheep didn't do anything! That was dope as hell. That was dope. <laughs> this is cool. Oh. Ooh, ouch. Oh. Not the car. That's gonna leave a mark. I'd rather die than you think I Whoa! Is she, did she just die? She said, I'd rather die than... Okay. <gasps> oh, God. Bulletproof glass. Thank God. <laughs> oh, damn. That guy lived? Oh shit. Oh god. You done fucked up now, dude. Oh shit. Oh, that's fantastic. That's fantastic. <laughs> Fuck your cars. Are your cars bulletproof? Hell nah. Oh. Oh. I love that. Can I get the smoke feature on my car? That would be amazing. I get the rail guns on mine. <laughs> Stupid. Get out of my way. I don't want to hurt anybody. I just want them to move. See, if you put the smoke, then you can get around them and they can't see shit. Very nice. Very nice. Well done. All the chase scenes, all the action sequences to open these movies have been fantastic. Is she unaware of her connection to all this? Did Blofeld like use like the mind wipe needle on her? This is it. I will let you know that you're okay. You won't. I'll never see me again. Boom. That's it. Madeline's gone. Damn. I don't think that's the end of her story. Oh. That was a crazy intro. I really like, and I talked about this in Spectre, I really like when movies can bring the past back to the present in a seamless kind of fashion. Some Billie Eilish. Remy Malek's in this movie? That's gonna be fantastic. Hell yeah. She has such a good voice.
I love the opens in these movies. I know, it's so good. Falling for a lie. Wow. Ooh, that's cool. With the sands of time. Clock's ticking. Mm. That's crazy. The, the whole, what's that, DNA? Made out of guns shooting at each other. Mm-hmm. I love trying to analyze what we're going to get in the movie based off of the intro. Right. I mean, this feels a lot like Spectre in terms of the past coming back, being a key story element, obviously getting that flashback of Madeline as a childhood and what she was dealing with, Mr. White being her dad, the daughter of Spectre. This is very pretty. Oh, there's the masks. That's cool. Oh, look at that. On the side of a frickin' building, of course. Oh. <sighs> Looks like some special ops. Hell here. on earth, no. Just, you know, just a straight shot down. Oh. Like favorite. <laughs> Being suspended by ropes. Just love it so, so much. And the hanging upside down for that matter. Hell on earth, no. Oh my God. Oh, cool camera move. That is neat. Oh, shit. Very cool. You know the uh, SL5, the weaponized smallpox I was using this morning? Have you seen it? No, though, you haven't seen the top of smallpox, have you? This was a good soup. Now, now it is waste. <laughs> what the hell? Today, I will put Ebola in your tea. Oh, and then shit. I will watch as your face is sweat blood. Damn! Spectre. Safin. Do not try to stop them. This is what we've been waiting for. They will not kill you. They think they need you. Transferring the files as we speak. What do I do with it? Swallow it. Goodbye. Swallow it. Oh, that shit. That can't be good for your stomach. I'm just a thought. Oh, my God. <laughs> Damn. Open the biosecurity level four fridge. Give me the weapon. Heracles. It requires double authentication. Oh, This feels oh. like the rock. <gasps> oh my god. Why did they fuck they every single time they shoot a weapon in this movie, now I'm jumping. Hell on earth, no! Why? <laughs> Why with the heights, man? The ground, it's so nice. Why do we have to go up in the high? Oh God, Ugh. I don't like it. Whoa. Whoa, dude, that's dope. That is awesome. Okay. That is some cool ass tech. And then it just blows everything up. Wow, dude. Sir, what's the Heracles project? This lab isn't on the books. No, it's not. They were casualties. It was a gas leak. Shall I alert the PM? It was a gas leak. I'll handle it. Money, Penny. Where's 007? <laughs> that sucks for... Sailing on his yacht. Well, not a yacht. He's heartbroken right now. 
on his beautiful sailboat in paradise, it looks like. That's sad. I mean, if I was sad, I would also like to stay there, but... You know, his heart is broken. Well, isn't this a surprise, Felix? James. <laughs> Here's the blown. Logan Ash State Department. It's really nice to meet you. I'm a huge fan. <laughs> Where's the package? Cuba. You love it there. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Valdo Obrachev. You're gonna say you never heard of it? Never heard of it. Didn't he defect during your tenure at MI6? Abrachev was kidnapped three days ago from a secret MI6 lab in London. Two days ago, his mug pinged on a facial recognition sweep in Santiago de Cuba. Spectre. I have a contact there. They're gathering. Coincidence? This guy. I know. <laughs> You're really the only guy for the job. You're the guy. This. Dude is way too much fanboying right now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hello. I saw you on the side of the road. I'm Bond. Yeah. James Bond. Want to have a drink? <laughs> if somebody ever hit me with their last name first and then their first name, I'd be like, get out of here, dude. Unless it was Bond. James Bond. Whatever. Oh, uh -oh. shit. In trouble? Constantly. <laughs> Need that ride? <laughs> Hold on. Is that a gun in your pocket or are you just happy to see me? Gun is digging into my hip. Stop it! There's always like Finkel jokes is about. <laughs> my horn is Finkel. Stop it. I'm sorry. You're dumb! But there's always like age jokes in this. Nice house. Thank you. Is that the bedroom? It's just that easy. Damn. When you're Bond, James Bond, all you gotta do is just make eye contact and it's over. Yeah. No chance. Or she's here to kill him. Oh. It's not the first thing I thought you'd take off. I'm here as a professional courtesy. Oh, damn. I've broken my car. It's Commander Bond. You know that. Double O? Two years. Very young. High achiever. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> You're a man who only has time to kill, nothing to live for. So Valdo Oprachev is off limits. Get in my way. I will put a bullet in your knee. Okay. Ouch! Dude, seriously, with the age stuff. By the way, I'm not just any old double O. I'm double O seven. Wait. You probably thought they'd retire it. It's just a number. Huh. See you in Cuba? Is that who M was talking about? Get me double O seven? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not Bond? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Double O seven. M, darling, a couple of things. Bond. I met your new double O seven. She's a disarming young woman. <laughs> Obrachev, you kept him on the payroll, didn't you? Stay out of it. This has nothing to do with you. It's Spectre. What have you done? Uh oh. Yeah. The call is coming from inside the house. Double O trouble. CIA have the advantage. Give me Blofeld. Sir, he only speaks to a psychiatrist. I know, the live feed's what I want. He's like this every day. Mad as a bag of bees. Good. What is it? It's nothing. It's clean as can be. He's lost his mind. Felix, I'm in. He's in. There's a young lady in Santiago I want you to meet. Of course there is. <laughs> Paloma? You're late. I... Vamos. I'm something about a hat. Paris. Where? I call me though. Si, si. I, I, I forget things when I get nervous. This is the biggest job I've ever had. They're in Knives Out together. Yeah. <laughs> it's your room? It's a wine cellar. Don't you think we ought to get to know each other just a little bit before we, um... Oh, no, 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 I didn't know. 
All right. You do it. Thank you. This is gonna go brilliantly. I know. I've done three weeks training. She's oh, adorable. Geez. She is adorable. <laughs> three weeks training. Oh no. He does look nice in a suit, or not a suit, a tux. He cleans up real nice. Will this sample be enough for you? If he has used it, yes. It is now progressing. Oops. Terrible, terrible gloves. So slippery. Forgive me. Aha. To happy new future for Spectre. No, it is ready. Oh shit. Is this gonna be like a hell of an air freshener? But what did he swap out? You know, to a party like this. How do you think I got this job? Remember, we're looking for our Russian scientist. I'm seeing a lot of Spectre agents. And it looks like all of them. Friend of yours? Cyclops. We ran into each other in Italy. Cyclops. <laughs> ah, eye opening you. He's got jokes. He's always got jokes. I've spotted him. See you. Have you got him? I'm here. I got him. You're there. Stay with him. But I see you from my little eye. My little eye is high. What the hell? Yeah, it's weird. He is to the end of our pariah. My bird. My brother. James Bond. Goodbye, James. It's too late. already crawling under your skin. It's harmless to us, just to him. So delicious. Whoa. Oh, I see. He reversed it. Holy shit. It is working. It is working, only Spectre are dying. Oh, shit. Fantastic. That guy better fucking run, though. Oh, nice. that was fantastic! <laughs> oh, chug uh, this. Kit. Yep. What was that? Oh. She's doing great. Three weeks of training, she's doing amazing. Oh, this fucking guy with his eye. That's so nasty. Did you clean that off, bro? Honestly, that was on the ground. Like, with people's dirty shoes, and you just stuck that right in your head. Gross. Oh, hello. May I cut in? Oh no! Hold him up. Oh. Damn. Okay, shit! Was the new 007 in Captain Marvel? Everybody's got a gun. <laughs> oh, when you're out of ammo, just hit him with the gun. I love it. Damn, girl. She's doing great. She's really doing a good job. All Damn. in those heels, too? Honestly. Badass. Oh, shit. Her reactions are kind of funny though. She's I, just I like, huh? It. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> oh, and they got the wind going. Three weeks training? Really? More or less. Salute. Salute. <laughs> Gotta calm the nerves. Sure. <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's fantastic. Dana! <laughs> you okay? I'm great. She's funny. <laughs> it's very much a Bond type of move. Shoot the thing that explodes, cause a diversion. 
You were excellent. You too. Next time, stay longer. Ciao. Ciao. That was fun. That was. She was fantastic. <laughs> I wonder if that's in the training handbook for double O's. Right. It's like, if you've got a lot of people pointing guns at you, find something that'll explode to distract them all. You don't have to shoot all of them and kill them. You just do that to get away. We've seen that in every movie, I feel like. At least make it look hard. Thanks, Felix. You woke me into a trap. A trap? Spectre's dead. Who's dead? All of them. You were never the intended target. He was a target? Why? I changed the DNA like we decided. Now the plan is complete. He is out of line here, Felix. Did M Ash. order you to kill Spectre? Don't answer that. M helped me build it. But please, he does not have the vision. Well, who does? To use who it. does? Oh! Oh, shit. Oh, no! You just shoot Felix in the fucking chest, bro? You knew this dude was sus with the way he was smiling and fanboying out for Bond. Right? Oh. Damn. They are like full blown. It looks like they're actually fighting. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. shit. about you when I get a feeling in my gut Ash might not be on our side oh shot in the stomach you just stay put keep the pressure on that I'm gonna find us a way out I'll be over here <laughs> you gotta love that jokes <gasps> oh that sucks they're out in the middle of the ocean dude holy shit I was gonna say, historically, we've seen plenty of people survive stomach wounds to the stu to know. the stomach, bullet shots to the stomach, but not under these circumstances. You got this. I got this. Make it worth it. Oh, Felix, no. It's a good life. The best. Damn it, dude. Wow. If there's anything you can do, can you please not let me drown to death? That'd be great. Biggest fear. I don't also don't want to die in fire. This is awful. This is awful. Could you even get that door open with the, the pressure? Bond can. There just happens to be a lifeboat available. Oh shit. Wild. I'm really enjoying this movie so far. Me too. I think it's a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Aw, it's the doggy. The dog. Oh, what do we got? Yeah, buddy. He's always got the flyest looking cars. That is the, oh God. I love the music kicks up. <laughs> Look at all those rooftops that he could destroy. If you have information, I'd be happy to receive it. Get me into Belmarsh. No. Blofeld's the only member of Spectre still breathing. I can't risk that. Oh, but you will risk developing a DNA targeting weapon with a corrupt scientist. There was nothing to suggest that Obrachev was working for anyone else. I had him down. My God, you're thirsty at the moment. <laughs> uh. If you've nothing left to give, you are irrelevant. Ouch. So you're not dead. Hello, Q. I've missed you. Were you expecting somebody? Um, no. I need you to tell me what's on that. I presume Emma doesn't know that this is happening. No, but there's something going on, Q. We need to find out what it is. Well, it's never nine to five, is it? Nope. 
Um, it's a database. DNA. Multiple individuals. Oh, shit. Um, Obrachev is working for someone who managed to kill all of Spectre. Not all of them. Blofeld. That's wild that all of Spectre was in that room. This can't just be Spectre. Oh, my God. There are thousands. Who are they? There have been uh, breaches around the world of databases holding DNA information. Can't imagine they're leaving us out, whoever they are. Blofeld will know who they are. Hugh, you need to get me into Belmarsh. There's only one person he'll speak to. Jim says no one has access. Did he? Can I just have one nice evening, please, before the world explodes? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh. Ah, I knew we didn't see the last of her. I'm sorry I'm late. I wasn't expecting any patient. Oh. Sorry if I surprised you. Foxgloves. Beautiful. I found them friendly. You know, if you eat them, they can cause your heart to just... Stop. Oh, I was like, explode? What are we waiting for? The complexion of his skin makes me feel like he was in the open. Right, that he was the guy. My father had a garden, he taught me. He died when I was young, but my interest remained. But he doesn't feel old enough. It's difficult right. to lose a parent, especially at a young age. Death has a particular effect on children. What effect did it have on you? Profound, but I saved a life once. Yeah, that's him. Saving someone's life connects you to them forever. They belong to you. I'm not very good at talking about myself, so I brought a memory ball. Are things starting to like click for her? Is she kind of thinking about? I hope so. I hope this is clicking. Oh yep. God. Yep. I never forgot your eyes. Under the eyes. They needed me. This shock to see them so many years later. Wow. What do you want? Just a favor. Is that all? You murdered my mother. And your father killed my entire family. Oh, shit. I need you to visit someone for me wearing this. It's harmless to you. You are the only one who can do it. Why would I do anything for you? I am a man willing to kill the person you love most. There is nothing you can threaten me with. Bond. James Bond. <laughs> it's very sad to hear, Madeline. But this is not true. So is this dude working for Blofeld? I feel like. Because at first I thought she, because she has access to Blofeld, I thought maybe. Yeah. Uh, Bond's in the office. What? <laughs> God, I haven't seen you in, 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 in a... Uh, how is your retirement? Shut up, Q. I know he's staying with you. <laughs> what happened? He's been reinstated as a double O. Double O what? What have you got? Q has studied the blood samples I gathered from the victims of the funeral. This is the funeral of one of the dead Spectre agents from Cuba. And here are the members of their family who made physical contact with the corpse. We found Heracles in the blood samples of all of them. Oh, that's good work, Naomi. Thank you, sir. Double O what? <laughs> Microscopic bio robots that can enter your system by the slightest oh, contact with your skin. Oh, this feels very, what? um, what was that cartoon? Programmed with DNA to target specific individuals. Big Hero 6. Which have modified the nanobots so that they can kill anyone related to the target. Holy shit. Could target a range from individuals to whole ethnicities. Oh, shit. You got your wish. Go to Blofeld and see what you can get out of him and find that cockroach, Obrachev. That, I mean, that just sounds insane. We didn't get the answer. What's his double O? The fact that she could spray that as like a perfume 
and then get into the room with the person that it's supposed to attack and it just attacks. That's crazy. He's the most valuable asset this country has. I know you and he have a history, but don't let him get in your head. If you feel yourself losing control... Oh, Tana. Relax. I'm not going to lose... Yeah, you might. Ugh. Dr. Swan, good afternoon. Mr. Bate. Oh. All right, so it is designed to kill Blofeld. Unless Bond falls over right now, bleeding out of his face. Right? Unless they need to be in like a closed room. This is... Dang, talk about Hannibal Lecter. Right? You made a Magneto reference during the Silva situation. It was That's very. what this feels like. Yeah. <laughs> this is creepy as shit. <laughs> God. Oh, how's your eyeball, bud? Ugh. Open the door. Open the door. Don't. What is it? You don't know what this is. Don't make me do this. Open the doors. Did he make enough contact with her arm? I don't know. Hello, Blofeld. <laughs> My sweet James, what do you want? Your enemies are closing in, Blofeld. If you tell me who they are, I could save your life. My avenging angel. My chaser of lost causes. I love this guy. He's a great actor. Yeah, Cuba was a disappointment. Huh? But we all cry on our birthday. Why are we here? Look at us, two old men in a hole trying to work out who's playing tricks on us. <sighs> she still loves you. Did you know that? And you broke her heart and she betrayed you. She is irrelevant. Ouch. Dang. She's very good at hiding things. And when her secret finds its way out, it'll be the death of you. Just tell me who they are. And then I'll, I'll leave. I'll, I'll leave you on your own. No, I don't, I don't want you to leave. We're just getting reacquainted. Careful, Bond. It was me. Oh, this is very Game of Thrones. <laughs> Vesper's grave. It was me. What Len didn't oh. do a thing. It was all me. Oh my she God. led you straight there from the goodness of her heart. And then you left her. My poor little cuckoo. You were always so very. Very sensitive. This is so interesting. Die. Hmm? Die. Blofeld. Die. Open the door. Cuckoo. You have violated the most important rule in the whole bloody playbook. Oh my god, did it work? Did he get close enough? He touched him with both yeah. hands. Holy shit, dude. He's dead. Oh no. How do I get this off? Oh, you don't, you can't. Nanobots aren't just for Christmas. Once Heracles is in your system, it's there forever. That's fucked up. Wow. Heracles sucks. <laughs> Oh, it's the house. Only not in winter this time. Back to the beginning. I don't know if you wanted me to come here and why you tried to kill Blofeld or who gave you the poison to do it or how long you've been working for them. But I do know for what felt like five minutes of my life, I wanted everything with you. Aww. I'm not going to leave here without you knowing that I have loved you. And I will love you, and I do not regret a single moment of my life that led me to you. Except when I put you on that train. Damn, dude. Do you know the worst thing about you? My timing. <laughs> <laughs> my sense of humor. Don't. You look incredible. Um, 
Oh. Hello. I'm James. Go, Slinky, go! Is that his baby? Oh, man. Does James Bond have a baby? Look at the eyes. She has his eyes. Those eyes are blue as hell. She's not yours. Oh, oh. damn it. But, um, the, okay, the blue, blue eyes. Then. Oh, see? <laughs> Even he noticed the blue ass eyes. She's lying to him for sure. That's his baby. Blofeld ordered my father to assassinate this family. The boy survived. His name is Lucifer Seffen. When I was a little girl, he came here to kill my father, but he found me and my mother instead. He spared my life, and now he's back. And what does he want? Revenge. Me. Who were they? Spectre's poisoners. My father held a banquet for them, used their own recipe in the dessert, dioxin. They would have suffered horribly. Holy shit, dude. The family had an island. They called it the Poison Garden. Blofeld took it from them and kept running it. You keep one wolf alive. There are a thousand reasons why we need to find this man. You just gave me a reason to kill him. She's so cute. We're gonna be a dad. I mean, those eyes, it's, I mean. <laughs> Did 007 manage to locate Logan Ash? She's closing in on him. I'll send you her location. I, I thought she was following Logan Ash, not me. Oh, shit. Put her in the back. Why do we have to involve a child? Honestly, every time. Uh oh. With a baby in the car, come on, man. This is have to gonna be your best escape driving ever, James. Thinking back to when he put her on the train, she grabbed her stomach. I think that's his baby. I noticed that too. She did like one of those, right? Yeah, like I need to tell you. Oh no! Ooh, nice maneuver. Solid, solid. Dang! That's fantastic. I love it so much. Piece of cake. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, geez. stop it. Stop it right now. Just like 10 new people right out of the woods. And a helicopter. <laughs> Shit. Oh! Oh! Dude, he's doing a phenomenal job. He's literally killing it. Literally. Yeah, go into the forest. Helicopter can't follow you in there. But those oh damn bikes can. Yeah. Damn it. I know. Yeah, he's in dad mode. Dad, dad mode. <laughs> he is, honestly. And he's doing great with his road rage because he hasn't said a thing. This feels like Jurassic Park. Oh shit. Oh, what the hell? Oh, oh. she's amazing. But don't shoot at my baby. And my baby daddy. <laughs> oh, what? Anybody comes through that door, you shoot them. Unless it's me. Wow, what a nice little hiding spot. Right? Oh, hell That's yeah. That's a hell of a gun right there. Looks like he's got a grenade launcher on it, too. Perfect for the helicopter. Yup. Damn. I recognize that shit from Tarkov. That attachment. Boom! Damn. <laughs> All right, that's fantastic. <laughs> Oh, that's even better. Yep, clothesline. 
It's that big brain of James Bond. I mean Bond, James Bond. Oh, this is gonna suck. Oh! <laughs> oh! That probably like hurts like a lot. I don't know if you gotta shoot the guy after that, personally. Oh, this fucking guy's face is so creepy. What are you, a stormtrooper? Jesus. Dang. It kinda does feel like Endor a little bit. Little Ewoks are gonna come rock running out. Who do you work for? Oh shit. <laughs> oh, oh, and he pushed it! Oh, you got squished, bud! What a horrible way to die. <laughs> That's brutal. Oh shit. Oh no! Revenge is always a great motivator for the villain. And he's a great actor. Man, the last three movies have had some really great actors in there as their villains. All of them. Except the second one. Quantum of Solace was... No, that's... Yeah. He was okay. Never fully sold me. But every other movie was awesome. We took Dr. Swan and her daughter. I, I didn't know she had a daughter. Did Em get my plane? Our plane. I'm coming with you. Thank you, Templar 7. Sir, permission for Commander Bond to be redesignated as 007. Aww. It's just a number. Very well. <laughs> Welcome to your family. How are you progressing? So, so good in Easter stuff. So, so good. My request? What is that? Insurance. A simple hair falls from your head, and now I have your life in my hands. Great. And yours. How damaged you must be to threaten a little girl. You're any less damaged. You love a killer. You bore his child despite his rejection. Yep, that's Pond's baby. You will do anything to survive. You understand me the same way I understand you. Wow. Dude's kind of scary. Do you like it here? No. But you will learn to. I grew up here, and you will too. Perhaps we should have some tea. Make her see the light. No, you can't separate us! Betty, Mama! Don't worry. You have me. Uh, that's not a good thing, bud. Oh, I hate it! If you have a line of sight on the island, drop altitude, stay below radar. You have a flown one of these things before. Nope. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Holy shit. <laughs> That's awesome. I don't want to be in it, but that looks cool as hell. <laughs> That is cool as hell. All right, and go underwater, stop it. Man, Batman ain't got shit on them. I mean, the budget that these departments must have to have this incredible tech. Right. It's just... It's Endless just, amounts of money. Yeah. Look out for cameras. Use your watch, Bond. Oh, so you could use those over and over? There's not like a, a usage limit? You can just keep using that thing. Fucking cheat code right there. <laughs> this facility is wild. Honestly, there's so many employees here. Like, do all these people even know what they're working on? <laughs> they're just there. Move. Oh. Blood. Oh, yeah! This is suicide mission. You will never leave this island alive. That was the farm. And this is the factory. They're mass producing it. Wow. They're not just attacking individuals. They're going to kill millions. It will not fit in a suitcase this time. It's really getting on my nerves. 
I'll shut him up. In the mouth. My nose. Oh, sorry, in the nose. <laughs> My bad. We have to destroy this whole facility. There is no need for violence. You have something of mine, and I have something of yours. Why don't you come up and we can talk about it? Like adults. Like adults? Shut up. Do you know what this flower does? It makes you blind. Just a drop of this in your eye, and you'll never see again. Losing one eye is a tragedy. No games. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, buddy. Good job, Mom. James Bond, history of violence, license to kill. Vendetta with Ernst Blofeld in love with Madeleine Swan. Could be speaking to my own reflection. We've made slightly different choices. No, we've just developed different methods for the same goal. Only your skills die with your body. Mine will survive long after I'm gone. Remy is so good at this. Doesn't have to be ugly. You leave my baby alone, I leave yours. What do you think? I think you're right. We both know what it feels like to have everything taken from us before we're even in the fight. No one wants to admit is that most people want things to happen to them. We tell each other lies about the fight for free will and independence, but we don't really want that. We want to be told how to live. People want oblivion. Few of us are born to build it for them. Oh, dang. So here I am, their invisible god. Jesus. I want the world to evolve, yet you want it to stay the same. Let's face it, I've made you redundant. Not as long as there are people like you in the world. And with all due respect to the enormity of your tidy achievements, all you're really doing I is love the up close a very face. long line of angry Shots. little men. I'm not angry, just passionate. Disable your explosives, get off my island, and you can take this precious little angel with you. I just let you just destroy the world. Sure thing, bud. What mother wouldn't sacrifice herself for her own child? Is that what happened to yours? Oh. My mother lay at my feet as I watched her die. Oh, shit. <sighs> I'll do whatever you want. Yes, you will. I apologize. Simple choices, Mr. Bond. Oh, God. Do you want to die in front of your daughter? Or do you want your daughter to die in front of you? No, no, no. What is he about to do? Whoa, and a drop down floor? The fuck? Wow, he was ready for that. The first shipment is on the dock, ready for pickup, doctor. Our toy. Oh! Oh, good girl! It's a good baby right there. If you don't want my protection, then off you go. Oh, shit. She said, fuck off. Please just let me go. You don't have a chance anyway. I kind of like this guy. He's kind of funny. The, he is definitely like... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh, what the? Oh, oh, hell no. I do not need a laboratory to exterminate your entire race from the face of the earth. Holy shit. You know what time it is? Time to die. Ooh. Yeah, buddy. Yeah! Oh my god. That was awful. She's amazing. They drop down to a lower level. There has to be a stairwell down. <gasps> oh, honey. Oh. <laughs> oh, the baby. Do we have any Royal Naval vessels in the immediate vicinity? We are going to need an immediate strike on this location. This whole island is a manufacturing plant for Heracles. 
I don't want you to have this. Keep it warm. I have to finish this for us. I'll just be on it. Oh, jeez, not this again. nothing left to save far on my mark that room you were just in yes i know i know i've got to open the blast doors otherwise our missiles will bounce off it like they've hit a trampoline awesome so fun they all missed <laughs> they all missed bunch of stormtroopers Oh, that's fantastic. And they're all exploded. Oh. <laughs> he did the bond thing. He did the thing. He did the bond thing. He did it. He just did the he thing. He did it. Yeah. With the circle. Yeah. Yeah. Thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The bond thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, bitch. Uh-uh. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. That was fantastic. Oh, shit. Oh, no, no, no. Ah! <laughs> Run. <laughs> Oh my god. This is a lot. It is. <laughs> oh shit. These freaking bombs. Jesus. Everyone's got a hand grenade. Oh, you can't hear again. <laughs> Those nades keep fucking everything up. Dude, how does he not just completely lost his hearing by now? Because he's Bond. James Bond. Oh, shit. Body armor, literally. How many friggin' people are there? There's so many. Oh, oh, behind you! Oh, got it. Got it. Uh-oh. Oh, it's that guy. Wait, didn't he go blind? Uh, yeah, I thought... Oh, maybe she was fucking with him. Uh, or does I mean, the hot tea. Or does the mechanic... The mechanical eye. Oh, there we go. Good question, good question. Oh, the eye! The eye! Oh, shit! <laughs> that was awesome! That was awesome! Oh. <laughs> Sounds like you're in a rugby scrum. I just show someone you'll watch. Really blew their mind. Why does it... <laughs> Why doesn't it mess mind. with his communication, though? I don't know. But it blew his mind. Yeah, that was... He's... I mean, he's got jokes in the most intense of... He's intensive a dad. Mo yeah. He's got dad jokes. Yeah. Is that like plot armor right there that the watch doesn't mess with his communication? Or did Q set it up that way? I'm sure. That was dope as hell, though. That was really cool. Admiral M here. What are my instructions? You have permission to launch. Roger. Dude, he is going through it. <laughs> He's just like, what kind of mess am I going to have to clean up after all this? Right. I'm going to have to answer to how many different nations? <laughs> oh, shit. Can we get out first, though? Maybe? I don't know. What? What now? I mean, he's got nine minutes. He's got plenty of time to so just... Oh. Can't leave that behind. Nope. Oh, he's oh, no. hit. Uh oh. Right, a mess with me like an animal. Oh, oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, he broke that arm. He broke that arm. Now we are both. Poisoned with heartbreak. Two heroes in a tragedy of our own making. Anyone we touch, we are their curse. A kiss would 
kills me instantly. Oh, awesome. Great. Yes, madam. Yes, Matthew. What? You made me do this, you see. Oh, I love that. I love it when you made me. This was your choice. Wow, dude. Shit. Are they safe, Q? Yes, they're safe. Will this bond not make it out? How do I uh, destroy this? If you get it on you. You know as well as I do that you can't. It's it's permanent. It's eternal. Would you put Madeline on, please? Yes, of course. How stupid of me. Holy shit. Is it done? Yes, yes. He's, he's dead. Have you left? No. Um... I'm not gonna make it. What? I know you can do this. Everything's good now. There's no one left to hurt us. You have made the most beautiful thing I have ever seen. She's perfect because she came from you. Yes. There must be a way. <sighs> this is brutal. We just need more time. If we only had more time. You have all the time in the world. I love you. I love you too. Very hard to know what to say, but I thought we should gather and remember. And I, I thought this was appropriate. <sighs> the function of man is to live, not to exist. I shall not waste my days trying to prolong them. I shall use my time. To James. 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 Back to work. I didn't think a Bond movie was gonna make me cry. Mathilde, I'm going to tell you a story. About a man. His name was Bond. James Bond. James Bond. Aww. She's so precious. Wow, what a shot. I kept them in. I, the tears didn't fall. I kept them in. <laughs> what, there's no like post credit to show that he lived or anything? Right, I was waiting for him to like, Damn walk Damn it. In. I was waiting for him to walk in the room. <sighs> wow. That, I mean, we're gonna talk about the whole series, I think, towards the end. Yeah. But like, that movie, along with what Spectre did, it really just tied in so much history, I feel like, yes. in terms of the Bond series and the characters and so many different moving parts involved with all of this. And the fact that they opened up this movie with that flashback with Safin and Madeline, like, yeah. 
that was really wild. That was really, it was really good. I really liked it. Hundred mm-hmm. percent. Like, I thought that overall, again, with movies like this, when you're in like the fifth installment, I feel like the story is essentially there already. Yeah. I feel like the villain is probably one of the most key elements of these type of movies because everything's already in place. You've already got Bond, who's amazing. You got everyone supporting Bond, amazing. It's just having that foe to go against Bond, I feel like is so important in these movies. And with the exception of Quantum of Solace, in my opinion, I think every movie had a bad ass villain. Yes. I loved all of them. Honestly, I can't even remember the, the villain from that one now. I mean, he was he was semi-forgettable, in my opinion. Also, granted, the other villains in the other four movies yeah. were all like S-tier actors that are just so good in that type of role. And it, it's just well done in terms of the way they were able to tie all the stories around. I didn't think Bond movie would get so emotional. I didn't. Think I we definitely were, didn't think so. I, well, I, I also didn't think there'd be a child involved. I, when she, when she, like, I noticed when she touched her baby or touched her belly when they said goodbye. That was. But it didn't like register yeah, until, until saw later. The baby, yeah. yeah, and like the moment you saw her eyeballs, you're like, oh yeah, that's. That's James's They did a great sure. job on the casting. 100%. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Bond's eyes are so blue that there's only probably a handful of people whose eyes are that blue. And it's like, that baby has blue eyes like that? Yeah, mm-hmm. that's his kid for sure. But just, I, I really like, and it's I think it's kind of difficult to do, to be able to tie in so much old history and yeah. backstory and bring it full circle. I think that's pretty challenging. I feel like they did a really good job through these movies to be able to tie the last two into the past yes. with the whole Spectre storyline. It was so good. Yeah. I really I, enjoyed this. I thought it was really well done. Overall, I, I thought this was another really good, like, I think all of them were really good in their own right. Yeah. Obviously, we have to play the ranking game because that's what we do. And then I think once we rank, we could talk about the whole Bond series as a whole and then we could take some of the questions. Right. Um, But I think for me, I think it's easy. Mm-hmm. I think it's really easy how I'm going to rank these. I'm going to keep Casino Royale 1. Okay. I think Skyfall is still 1B. Yes. I, those two, I I absolutely loved Skyfall. There's just something special for me with Casino Royale. I, I, I don't know what it is. I think I'm going to put this one third. I think, I think this is third. Spectre's four. And Quantum of Solace five. I'm going to have to agree with you on all of that because I just, I like Casino. It was like... It, you know, the one that, like, got us into this, and it's, like, ugh, introducing us to Daniel Craig. Right. Was fantastic. He was awesome as Bond. I I think I could go... The thing is, my top four, I feel like one and two are interchangeable, and I feel like three and four are interchangeable. Yeah. Like, Spectre and No Time to Die, I feel like are pretty... I just like the way, because this was the finale, and I thought it ended in a really proper manner. Yeah. I think it's really hard to end movies like this, and killing off Bond... Obviously, is a really, really difficult task and a really difficult decision to make, I feel like. They did it in such a good way, I though. thought it was... Yeah, I, I think that's why I give it a small nod. Just because anytime you end a five-movie series like this, it's not even just a trilogy. It's five movies. That's difficult. We really watched five movies. Yeah, five of them. These type of rankings, I, I said it in the last movie reaction. I feel like if I watch Casino Royale tomorrow, solidifies my number one. If I watch Skyfall next week, oh, like, oh, that's my favorite now. And then if I watch No Time to Die, which has been on TV lately, it always happens this way with our movies that we watch. It always pops up in the cable channels. It's like, oh, that's kind of ironic. And you're like, quick, go pass, yeah. go pass, go pass. I feel like if I watch that next week, that'll jump into like my third spot. Like, I feel like they're so interchangeable because they're all really good. I don't think there's any question that Quantum of Solace will always kind of stay. Which is unfortunate. I mean, they they had struggles that they had to deal with, with the whole writer strike. I think it was a writer strike. And, I mean, it was the shortest movie. These movies, two and a half hours, this one was a little bit more than that. I feel like these movies need that. Most of them didn't introduce their villains to, like, the hour mark. Yeah. And it just lets the whole story breathe, and it allows you time to tell the story. Hour and a half's not long enough for a Bond flick. No. Because it's not just action, shoot, shoot, plow, plow, go through and finish the story. I'm sorry, how did that go? Shoot, shoot, cow, cow, plow, plow. I don't know what I said. But 
it, it's more than just a shoot 'em up action flick. Like yeah. there's story and there's backstory and there's meaning and there's relationships. And these aren't villains with just like, oh, I want to take over the world. Like, yes, Safin had that mindset, but he also had a lot of revenge intertwined into his plan. Which makes so, it like so much better. Yeah. I mean, when there's a personal, which is why I think Silva is my number one villain in the Bond series. It, that was too good. He was so awesome. And the way that, and, and I think that's part of what makes Skyfall so good for me is the way that like the that movie started, it's essentially what M did to Silva, and then it played out where like, oh, take the shot, I could risk Bond to save a bunch of other people. That's exactly what she did to Silva, and like that was his main core of wanting to get his revenge, and the way he did it was just unbelievable. And I, I just, there's so many elements of these movies that are so good, and I think Daniel Craig was I thought he was fantastic. I don't have a ton of knowledge of other Bonds. No. I mean, I saw... Just Sean Connery. I saw Pierce Brosnan's Bond a couple movies. But it's like, I thought he was amazing in these movies. I thought it worked so well. Did a really good job. I really enjoyed that. Yeah. I yeah. thought everything about these movies were a blast. And it's type of those movies... It kind of reminds me of John Wick to where I'd hate to rank them. Just because I put one movie at like four in the last spot... It doesn't mean I hated it. No. Where it's like, it's just difficult to rank because they're all good in their own right. And they're all got really great elements to them. And they're all fun and enjoyable flicks because, again, they're not just mind-numbing action movies. There's story involved. Yeah. There's backstory that you got to keep There's focused emotion. on. There's emotion. Yeah. I honestly didn't think I was going to cry during mm. one of these movies. The moment they introduced a kid, I'm like, okay. Here we go. But it wasn't even really the kid that made me... Well, I mean, yes, in in the aspect of, like, daddy's never going to see his daughter again. Right. It's not even that, like, he could have stayed alive and, like, what life is that? Yeah, for sure. And he he would have had to stay away from them. He couldn't ever right. be... He would have killed people. And it sounded like there was no them. way to fix it. No. It was irreversible from the sounds of it. But it's one of those things where <laughs> the ending is not even anywhere close to what I thought by the end of Casino Royale. Right. When Vesper died, I never thought he was going to even get close to another moment of I love you. I didn't think he was going to ever let that get there just because he fell for that, she died, and then it was like, oh, Bond's going to be the super cold dude now from now on. But that wasn't the case. Yeah, He tried. It, It wasn't the case. He just has too much love in his heart, and as we always say... It's always a love story. It is. Every single story that we ever watch is always about love it's in some way, love. shape, or form. It's amazing. Yeah. And the fact that a Bond movie ended with, like, love as the main focus, it's like, oh, my God. That's amazing. Yes. So I am so happy that we finally watched these movies. Mm-hmm. I'm so grateful that it won a poll, and then we went five weeks and watched all of them, and it was just absolute fantastic enjoyment. Great movies, great flicks, great stories. I love Great it. performances. Yeah, it's really good. The music's all amazing. Oh, yeah. Throughout. I mean, it's freaking, yeah. No, Rihanna, I mean, fucking. The opening sequences were some of the best things I've ever seen in any of these movies that we've watched. It was not Rihanna. It was Alicia Keys. Yeah. I'm so sorry. My bad. But it was just those opening sequences, the creativity, the way it foreshadowed into telling the story. Mm-hmm. So good. I loved every second of it. I thought it was fantastic, but... If you guys didn't know, we watch all of our movies live with the community. So it is time to check out what they are saying and answer some questions and see their comments. James, it's even better watching the intros on a second watch and understanding what all the foreshadowing meant. I love the freaking intros to these movies. They're so well done. Yeah. It's so like beautifully like animated or not animated. I mean, but they are. I mean, essentially, I mean, it was, it's not like it's, you know, real effects. It's... It's really well. It's very artsy. It's really awesome. And once I realized that the intros did give a foreshadow to what the movie was going to be, I really enjoyed trying to analyze them and watch them carefully and be like, oh, Bond keeps shooting himself reflections or shadows or whatever. Then like, oh, he actually encounters a former agent who's lived the same life that he lived and they're trying to kill each other. It's like it, it lines up so well. And I just... The intros were some of my favorite parts of because the music in the intros are all amazing. Yeah. And then the actual visuals throughout those intros, so good. Yes. I love the foreshadowing. So awesome. Mm-hmm. White Wolf, Craig has been the most injured actor to play Bond. Smashed out his two... Ooh! Smashed out his two front teeth in Casino Royale, tore his shoulder cartilage filming Quantum of Solace, 
Ruptured his calf muscles in Skyfall and broke his leg in Spectre. God damn. I mean, so did he do anything in this one? So I so I think that answers the question that he, he died did his in own this stunts. one. <laughs> yeah, he died. He died. But did you die? Yes, he did. I guess that I guess that solidifies that he did a lot of his own stunts. Mm -hmm. Which I mean the action sequences and the choreography of the fighting, all of it in every movie from beginning to end. I thought it was so good. I loved the fighting. Just hearing that, like, Batista broke his leg when he, because he told him to, like, stop taking yeah, easy stop, on me. Yeah, don't like, go easy on me. Just, and then he, like, okay, well, whoops. He's a professional wrestler who throws people around for a living. Yeah. So, ouch. Did you miss that class? Yeah, for sure. TC, thank you. Random note Adele, Sam Smith, and Billie Eilish all did amazing jobs with the opening things. And thank you for both reacting. It was amazing. Don't forget Alicia Keys. Thank you, TC. Yeah, I mean, yeah. the music and even just hearing the dialogue or the lyrics from those movies or from that music in the intros, it had so much foreshadow. Yeah. I Every aspect of those intros were so well done. I agree. Joseph R., thank you very much. What was your favorite part of this movie? It's so cool that you're actually watching this movie on Daniel Craig's birthday. Oh, it's wow. his birthday. Oh, that's fantastic. I did not know. Happy birthday, Daniel Craig. Maybe one day I will say your name correctly because I say it wrong every single time. Craig. Craig. Craig? I I feel like I'm saying it right, but I don't. I don't know that there's that many ways to say Craig. What was your favorite part of the movie? Um, I, I I think I can answer mine quick, pretty quickly. I like the history of everything tying into from Spectre and Bond's past and even Madeline's past and all that and being able to tie that into the story. I, I really like that aspect of storytelling very much when it's done right and I feel like it was done really good. And I just really like the emotion. Honestly, the when story. they made up, when they're standing in her childhood yeah. home, it's essentially that's when you're that with her a, baby upstairs yeah. and I love you and all that stuff. I love all that shit. I mean, every movie had amazing car chases, too. Oh, those were fantastic. When he was cruising through Italy, yeah, that was pretty spectacular. That so, was, I mean, I love all that stuff, that too. That was all fun. But, yeah, I love the emotion part. White Wolf, if you were like most of us and thought Ana de Armas deserves her own action movie based on the Cuba scene, good news. The director of John Wick is doing an action film starring her soon, oh. Ballerina. She's, she was, I thought we were going to get more of her in this movie. She's fantastic. She was funny. She was really <laughs> Like, funny. her approach was, like, her bubbly, like, excitement. Yes, like, oh, yeah. like, this is nothing. It's fine. Yeah. yeah. And then she was, like, total badass and totally yeah. just whooped everyone's booty. It was, yes. That whole scene, by the way, where they flipped the gas and the poison on everyone, where it was like, oh, Bond's going to die in front of everyone, but instead he killed all of Spectre, like. That was wild. That was awesome. Man versus machine, Nikki, 100% on the close shots. The last minutes of Bond's death are all close face shots. The cast was truly emotional about it being the end. Oh. I mean, anytime you I wrap love the up close a, stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that's I so mean, impactful. they're powerful. Yeah. They're emotional. Anytime you get that up close, you're telling a very specific, powerful moment of a story. And they were very effective in this. Yeah. I thought they were so well done. So as always, huge shout out to the community for joining us, watching live with us. And obviously the contributions are absolutely amazing. I mean, we appreciate everyone. Community is amazing. The Bond series has been fantastic. So enjoyable. I absolutely loved all five movies. I didn't think I would like it as much as I did. But then again, I really like action as of late. So. Yeah. And the action had story. And I think that's important. So... Awesome job. I love that it was recommended. I love that it won a vote and we just went five weeks straight. So good. Cool. Anything else? Yeah. All right. You guys share all your thoughts. Rank the Bond movies for us. Love to hear your opinions. We'll catch you guys later for the next one. Have a good one. Bye.